What is going on everybody? Welcome. I'm at the start of my trailhead. I'm gonna go check out a new trail and hopefully we'll find a cool camp spot there. But for right now, let's air down and enjoy this adventure. All right, I made it to camp. I decided to end the trail short. So the trail, it's uh, it's over there, it continues on down that way. Maybe about four or five miles. But I found this camp spot and I was like, mm, I feel like camping more than exploring. So let's just go ahead and call this camp. Maybe I'll do that trail another day. Or maybe tomorrow I'll finish it and just see where it ends. There is a big old fire ring down there, but no fires still. All right, I am going to get camp set up so I can enjoy being out here. Well, I got camp set up and I, you know, honestly, I chilled for a little bit and relaxed and, you know, that's pretty much what I'm going to be doing on this trip is chilling and relaxing. Something I did do is I busted out my salmon. I'm letting it defrost. It's getting there. It's almost there and then I'll stick it back in the cooler. I forgot to take it out last night. Um, but let me, let's, you know, walk around camp a little bit. I like it because, um... You know, it's like there's a ton of pine trees, but there's also whatever this tree is. There's those trees as well mixed in, which is creating, you know, more shade for me, which is beautiful. It's partly cloudy. Can't complain. So over here, we got a big old campfire ring. And it looks like someone did uh, <clears throat> something. <clears throat> And left their wood here. Once you can have fire, you can burn all that. The road I did come on, it's where, you know, where that big old fallen tree is. That's where the road is. And then it heads on down that way. 
which I was going to venture down that way. <clears throat> but, you know, when I stopped here, I hesitated to keep going. And I was like, you know what? That's a sign. Stay here. So I made this my camping spot. Weather is perfect, too. Can't complain. It's, let's see what the temperature is. It's, it's 80 degrees. 80 degrees, partly cloudy, giving me shade from the clouds and the trees that I have shade. It's like, it's perfect. I'm just gonna chill, relax, enjoy the peace and quiet, sights and sounds out here, and just, you know, yeah, enjoy my time out here. So let's do that. All right, well, it is 6.30. The sun, it's behind those clouds and the trees right there. So I'm gonna be in shade the rest of the, the day, the evening, into the night. So something I have been debating about the past hour is, do I wanna make my dinner or not? I was gonna make a salmon salad. Something quick and simple, easy. The only problem is, is I'm really not that hungry. So what I did on this trip is I actually made a turkey sandwich and I brought it with me. And when I got to camp and I, when I got camp all set up and everything, I was like, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to enjoy my turkey sandwich, some chips that I got, and then, you know, go from there. And the one thing that I'm realizing now, or, you know, about an hour ago is that I'm not hungry. Not at all. I had some fruit, some snacks, and that's pretty much I'm good. So honestly, I don't. I think I'm gonna skip dinner tonight and not worry about making the salmon and the salad, the salmon salad. You know, I am probably gonna make some tea in a little bit, and you know, I will say this has been a nice, just like do nothing trip. I think that, you know, that's really what it's turning into, like a do-nothing trip. It's it's something I, I really needed. So I think I'm just gonna, you know, keep doing that.
Good morning, everyone. I have just been lounging around, relaxing. That's pretty much what this trip has turned out. Pretty much just on that chair or taking a nap inside that tent. But now I am actually getting ready to make my breakfast because I am getting hungry. I got my some of my stuff right there. I did decide after I have breakfast, I am going to cook the salmon I have because I don't feel like cooking that at home. And I'll get that over with. And then I'll just chill and relax until it's time to pack up. All right, let's make this breakfast. Check it out guys, my breakfast. Right. Oh. I'm hungry. All right, I'm going to enjoy my food. It's not like you guys haven't seen this before. And I will see you afterwards. My breakfast was delicious. Now I'm just kind of headed over, just a little bit away from camp. Um, I kind of want to see what's over here. Last night when it got completely dark and I was just laying in bed chilling, I heard a bunch of crackling and then I just heard a and I was like, oh man, that was a tree that fell. It wasn't close to camp, but it was close enough to where I heard it and it uh, surprised me. Oh dang. You can see it kind of slopes and just uh, goes on down. Ooh. 
I see some trees down there, this down. But I wonder if one of those are like, maybe that one. Ooh, there's one right there. That looks like it's been down for a while though. Well, that's cool. After I heard that one tree fall somewhere over here, over on that side, I heard another tree like 10 minutes later fall as well. All right, well, I've just been uh, lounging, relaxing and enjoying. I ended up not cooking the salmon. I was like, you know what, screw it. I just wanna lounge and relax and just enjoy being out here more. Cause you know, it's it's weird. Like this trip, I'm out the same amount of time that I normally am, normally am on all my trips. But for some reason this trip, it just feels like I'm out here a lot shorter than I normally am, which I'm not, weird. Anyways, I have been slowly packing up. You can see I just have this little bit, that little bit, this stuff out. Everything that was in my tent is out and inside the truck. So I just have that little bit to go. So this is where I'm gonna leave you guys. So just like normal, I appreciate, I appreciate you. Remember, it is only impossible until it no longer is and hopefully I'll see you next time. All right, take care guys.